Hey everyone, I wanted to make this video uh, on this quick tip that I use to unclog my toilet without a plunger when occasionally it does get clogged. This happens about every, uh, I'd say two to three months. And this little tip is quick, effective, and it saves me money from having to call the plumber. A lot of the times, if even if you have a, a plunger, this works better and uh, clears the clog permanently. So all you're gonna need is a bowl and some dish soap and uh, so let's jump right into it. All right, as you can see, my toilet is clogged up. Every time I go to flush, the water uh, fills back up and almost overflows out through the sides. So I don't want that to happen. But all you're gonna have to do is take your dish soap. I'm using some Dawn here. And I usually pour in probably about a fifth of the bottle. Sometimes you can use more or less, but I usually found about a fifth of the bottle maybe eight ounces or so to be all you need. So once it's in there, you're just gonna wanna wait about 25 to 30 minutes and we'll be right back. Okay, and then what you wanna do next is get your bowl and turn on some hot, hot tap water. You don't wanna use boiling water because that could potentially crack your toilet bowl, but you just wanna use your tap water. Yeah, I usually use the stuff out of my sink. Wait till it gets you know hot enough to where it's it's almost unbearable to touch and then fill her on up. And then what we're gonna do is just dump this into the toilet bowl slowly. I usually do about two, uh, two bowls of these of this size, and that seems to work the best for, uh, for when I get a clog in my toilet. Yours may vary, but it, it can't hurt to use more hot water. So we'll add the first bit. Again, I add it slowly. Not very slowly, but you know, you just don't want to dump it all in too quick. And then I usually wait about a minute and add one more bowl. Okay, we got the second bowl added. Let's give it a shot. Like a glove, it just goes right down. I think this works so efficiently because the uh, the dish soap acts as a lubricant. Uh, it potentially might dissolve some of the um, the toilet paper. I'm unsure about that, but I think it just kind of lubes everything up down there. So when you do go to flush, I mean, it just sucks it right in. As you can see, it works like a charm. Well, everyone, that about sums it up on this easy to do and effective tip for unclogging your toilet. If this video was helpful for you, please give it a thumbs up and comment below. Um, Again, you know, you can use a plunger if you have one. I always don't have plungers in my bathrooms. I think they just kind of look um, not the best and, you know, they get dirty and clean. You know, I have to clean them once in a while and I just don't like how they look in my bathroom. So I always have been using this method. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. Uh, it also saves you from having to call a plumber. So a lot of the times, you know, I definitely give this method a try first before you call a plumber if you think you got a real serious clog. But I've been living in this house for about three years. I probably had about, you know, about 20 clogs. Um, I have a lot of parties and a lot of people and a lot of, you know, a lot of people over occasionally and family and, you know, they just use a lot of toilet paper and it gets backed up. So this has always gotten me, uh, getting my, gotten my clogs unclogged. So again, hope you found this video informative and take care.